Hey guys, today I am doing my spring clothing haul for you, like I said in my last. So over the last couple of months I've been doing a little bit of shopping and I wanted to show you guys what I've picked up for the new season, so I hope you like it. The first things I've got to show you are from everyone's favourite shop, Primark. So every time I go into Primark I just have to buy something. These clothes are from two different shopping trips. The first thing I've got are these jegging type trousers, not jegging, um, like tregging type trousers. They're basically really, really thick leggings because I love wearing leggings. Leggings are my favourite thing to wear. I live in leggings, I wear them all the time. But obviously I have to wear some sort of long vest or long top so that my bum doesn't show through my leggings because nobody wants to be seeing your knicker line through your leggings. These are like very, very thick leggings. They're still stretchy and legging material but they're much, much thicker which means you don't have to wear something to cover your bum. You can wear any normal top with these. And they have these jodhpur bits at the top which make, which because of the detail it makes them look more like trousers than just like the flat front of leggings. So these are great. I love wearing these because I think they look a lot smarter when I'm wearing them to like uni and stuff. I don't look like I'm just slouching around in leggings. And these were six pounds, I think. If you want a pair of thick leggings for everyday wear, then these ones are really, really good. The next thing I got was this top. This is a kind of gray slouchy top with this lace detail down the middle. So it's one of these ones with the sleeves which are kind of back wingy but not proper back wingy. It's, oh dear, it's longer at the bottom than at the top and I just love this lace detail down the front and what I like to do is wear a white vest underneath this so the lace, deal, lace detail really stands out and this is just great to wear with leggings on a day when you just want to be comfy but still want to look kind of nice and it's just the perfect slouchy but nice top and I think this was um, five pounds. I've taken all the labels off but I'm pretty sure this was five pounds. Next thing I've got is a jumper but it is a spring jumper. It looks like this. So I think this is just the perfect spring jumper. It's a mint green kind of colour I'd say. Turquoisey mint green. It's got these little buttons at the top which just add a little bit of detail. And it's just one of these thin jumpers because I have a lot, a lot of thick knit jumpers. I really love thick knit jumpers. But for spring, then I have a problem where my tops for summer are too cold. I get too cold, but I get too hot in my jumpers. So this is the perfect alternative, just a nice thin jumper. It's just basically really plain, really nice and goes with everything. I love putting little collars underneath this because that just looks adorable. And I've worn it with leggings, with jeans, with a skirt. It just goes with everything really. The last clothing item I picked up is probably my favourite purchase out of everything I've got to show you today. I'm so in love with this and so so happy I found it. It's this dress. Um, it is just, I, can, I have no words for this dress. It's a tea, dark tealy blue kind of colour with lots of patterning on so it's got stripe patterns with things down them. And then it's got these, I don't know what you call these, they're these oval patterns with like flowers inside them. And then it goes in at the waist and just kind of flares out a bit just above the knees. So it's a really simple um, shaped dress just with little puff sleeve t-shirts, like a normal neckline and goes in at the waist. Which I do really like, I do really like simple um, shaped dresses because I just think they look really classic and lovely. But then the pattern is just incredible it's so springy and summery i've worn it with tights and a jacket and it works as a kind of evening dress and i think it will look amazing in the daytime in summer it's only eight pounds and normally primark dresses are 12 to 15 pounds and this one was this one was eight because it's a really thin kind of silky material which is really really nice because it's light to wear and this is just my perfect dress i'm so in love with it i couldn't just it's everything i want in a dress and it's amazing. Last thing I picked up from Primark is more of an accessory and this, and it's this. This is a flower hair bun thing. So basically last summer I kind of got into flower crowns because I bought a flower crown at a theatre when I went to see something in the theatre. They had them on sale there for some reason and um, I loved it and it was a really small flower crown because I've tried those big flower crowns that were kind of in last year and because I have such thin hair it just didn't work. It just kind of made me look, just made my hair look even thinner. So I like finding flower pieces for my hair which aren't overly big and I saw this in Primark for £1.50 and basically what you do is when you have a bun, pop it round the base of it. So 
you just pop it around the base of the bun like this and I think this should just make any plain outfit springy and summery and I might keep this on now um, it just it could just make any plain outfit springy and summery and it's just a really subtle way to get flowers into your outfit it just works so well with a high bun I'd love to try it in a low bun I haven't tried that yet and I just think it's great and it's so pretty and it was £1.50 and I just think I'm going to get a lot of wear out of this because I love throwing my hair in a bun for spring and summer to get it off my neck and this is just a way to spruce it up a bit so that was a great find. Now as you guys may or may not know in February I went to see Taylor Swift which was incredible, she was amazing, it was like all my dreams come true in one night. Um, she was amazing and I told myself, I went with my best friend and we both told ourselves we weren't going to buy any merchandise because it's always overpriced and we walked past the stands with things like the t-shirts and the program on and the t-shirts were like 20 quid and we were like no, none of them are that special, no. And then, separate from all the merchandise shops, all the normal merchandise shops, this was in the O2, there was this little kind of proper shop thing that had completely different merchandise in and what it did have was these really incredible jumpers. They're, they were thin jumpers in a load of different Taylor Swift things and they were the softest things in the world and they were £25 and I got one. So my one says red Taylor Swift because, and this jumper is the softest thing in the world. It, um, I posted an Instagram photo of me wearing this a couple of days ago and it got loads of likes so I think you guys liked it. It's just got this really simple kind of slash neckline and it's in a nice slouchy shape. It's the softest thing in the world and I just think I'll get a lot of wear out of this. And this goes with everything and I love it and I love Taylor Swift and this is amazing. The next three things I have to show you are from charity shops. You guys know I love charity shopping, it's like my favourite thing to do. And where I've moved to in Bournemouth for uni, that I have, that I, I'm right by this high street which just has about 10 charity shops, which is the best thing in the world. Um, I love charity shopping. So I have three things to show you. The first one is this little top here. This is a really dark navy maroon kind of colour and it's a velvet crop top style and I just love it because it's really kind of not old fashioned but it just reminds me of something kind of 90s and not something that is sold anymore. It's got these really cute buttons down the side, it's got a V neckline and it's, I just thought it was a really interesting shape and material and I kind of had to get it because I just thought it would be really interesting to wear, like to style and it's all silky on the inside and I just thought this was a really interesting piece so I had to get this. The next thing I picked up a couple of days ago and that is this pink oriental style dress. Now I have wanted to find a nice oriental style dress ever since seeing the parent chat which is when I was really really young and one of the Lindsay Lohans, because obviously she plays both twins, um, it was at the scene where they take their parents to the boat for them to have dinner and she, one of them is wearing an oriental style dress, it's the American one that's wearing an oriental style dress and she just looked amazing in it and then there was this episode of Friends where Rachel wears an oriental style dress and I just really wanted to find a nice oriental style dress but not many places sell them and if they do they're really expensive but I found this in a charity shop for about £6 and I fell in love with it so it's a really kind of bright and dark, bright and dark that doesn't make any sense it's a fuchsia colour with um, much darker pink or are they black flower patterning down it and then the buttons at the top and the high neckline and it's very it's quite a tight kind of almost bodycon style dress so I think this would look really interesting on a night out or or if I wanted to make it more sophisticated if I put a jacket with it it could be great for like going out for dinner or something and I just thought it was really interesting and I couldn't just leave it I couldn't leave it because I've wanted you for ages so this is another thing I picked up from a charity shop it's this navy blue jumpsuit. Now this is going to be impossible to show you on a camera because it's a jumpsuit, it's very very long and it's got quite wide legs so basically I can only just hold it like this but I'll basically just have to show you the top half. So it's a navy blue jumpsuit, it's originally from River Island which is great because I got it for £6.50 and it looks brand new. Um, it's got these nice pleats down the front, these little gold buttons and then it ties like this at the neck. So these two ribbons here tie so then you get a bow around here or however high you want it and then it's got wide legs which look great with high heels so this is definitely more of an evening thing I've worn this once um, for a friend's birthday when we went out and I think it was just really different from wearing a normal dress I've never owned a jumpsuit before so that's kind of what made me like this yeah I think this is one of the best finds I've had in a charity shop because I'm assuming as it's a 
proper nice play suit from River Island that it was quite expensive originally and it seems brand new and I just, I loved wearing this, I felt really cool when I wore this and I think there's lots of ways and things I can wear this to so that was exciting. The last thing I picked up in the select sale and it's this black maxi dress. Now the only other maxi dress I own is a very, it's, it can still be a daytime one but it's a bit more on the dressy side and it's very summery so it's white with green patterning down it and it's absolutely beautiful but it's the kind of thing I only wear on very hot days or when I'm on summer holiday or in the evening. This is a completely plain black maxi dress which I think is great because there are so many different ways I can wear it. I've tried loads of different ways already, I've tied my denim shirt around it, I've put crop tops over it, I think it goes great with this flower crown and the long necklace, um, I've tried putting a jumper over it and that looks cool. So there are so many different ways I can wear this and I think I can wear it in most seasons but for spring and summer it will really work because it's just so plain and so simple but then there are so many different ways you can dress it up or down which is amazing. Um, so it's just a kind of staple piece which I can change into anything I want and I'm just really excited to wear this. So that is everything for my spring clothing haul. I hope you like this, hopefully I'll be able to do another haul sometime leading up to summer or maybe sooner. Um, so tell me what you've bought recently in the spring, what you love wearing in spring, um, and if you liked any of the items I bought. And um, give this video a like if you did like, subscribe to see more from me, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.